All right, so this part will be the CPU block, the tubing. So we're gonna start off with the tubing. Um, I got uh, one fourth inch, uh, I wanna say four feet of tubing for 498 at Home Depot. And then I got um, 10 fittings for 493. So like I said, there's gonna be barb fittings. I mean, these tubes here, I mean, it makes it really tight onto here without heating them up. So, that'll be good. So, there's tubing and fittings. I think these black or something look good, but, I mean, personal opinion. So, then I got this CPU block for $21. And this plate here goes on top here, and then you take these screws and they go down through here for your AMD or Intel, and um, they connect to the bottom of your uh, motherboard, the little plate that's down there. I can't remember what it's called right now. But um, I have done a lot of tests with this, and I don't have any leaks. This actually, these barbs fit tighter than my pump barbs, so there's kind of a problem there. But my pump barbs, when I use the fittings, they don't leak. Um, these get really tight on here just with like without the uh, uh, fittings they get on it really tight and it's almost impossible to get off see how much I'm struggling to get it off yeah see it ain't even coming off Some barb for you. I will leave the link in the description for the CPU block. It's twenty one dollars. It's United States shipping, free. So there's a water block and tubing part. Um, I'm not gonna mount this in because I'm still waiting for my radiator to come in, which hopefully it should come in tomorrow. And then um, I'll be doing my build tomorrow. I will make a video of the radiator explaining it and where I got it and how much I got it for and yeah thank you like comment subscribe see you tomorrow